first of all, I just want to say it was a really important uh, thing that we wanted to do for our fans. As everybody knows, it's been a difficult season for them, and, and I know it was a bit unconventional, but announcing you know, a player staying and doing it first uh, for our fans in the stadium is something we felt pretty strongly about and really pleased with the way it, it worked out. Um, I also want to say how pleased we are uh, to be able to keep one of our best young players. Uh, and as I was just talking to him next door, I, I think it not only says a lot about the club, I think it says a lot about him uh, as a man. Uh, we all know what kind of player he is. Um, but when he said in his statement there's loyalty in football, that says a lot about him, and that is who he is, uh, and it says a lot about his faith in the club and, and where we're going. You know, I, I, I've said repeatedly that it's, uh, this club is on a journey, uh, and my job fundamentally is to talk to as many people as possible about this great club and about that journey and try to convince people that you know, where we have been is not where we will be. Um, but I know that every week we play a match, and if the results don't play out in the way people want and the, the football doesn't play out that way, it's difficult for people to really believe that we're on that journey. And I think Fabian and I had quite a few conversations, and what's most gratifying for me is uh, he believes in that journey and believes where the club is going, and um, we're really pleased to be able to, to have kept him. And what uh, reaction have you had from the rest of the lads to the news that he's the, the lads are absolutely delighted. Uh, I mean. As soon as I told told some of the boys, they, they looked a bit shocked at first. A few of them, <laughs> but they they're right behind me. They they see they see a lot in me in terms of how I want to want to go about my career, how how dedicated I am, how I want to push on and try try get a bit more out of everyone else. And they they do the same for me, so they're delighted to keep someone like me here. And uh, I'm buzzing. I'm, like I said, I see that I don't see these guys as you know, teammates, or I'll turn up and turn up. I see him as family, I see him as brothers. I'd run through a brick wall for, for, for all of them. And, uh, you know, I'm just, I'm really excited I'm here. Yeah. I'm going to start crying in a minute. <laughs> I'll get <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, You came out at half time yesterday <coughs> and got a terrific reception from the fans as well. Did that reinforce your view and your faith in them? I've always had faith in them. I mean, they're, 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 they're a great, great bunch of fans. Uh, it was tough for me when I was when I was at Leeds. We had a great set of fans, so for me to for, for me to leave Leeds, it was a big big thing for me. I didn't really want to leave at the time, but it was right for the club, and I ended up leaving. And I'm thinking, don't think I'm going to see fans as good as as good as them again. As soon as I've come to Villa, I've been welcomed. I've loved every minute of it, and the fans have been great. Carlos Hill or Gilly, as you call him, what a goal that was! You had a watching brief. Incredible. No, he's been doing that all week in training, mm. and uh, it was no surprise when when he'd done it uh, against Bournemouth. I mean, I fell out of my seat. It was it was a great moment, and mm. to see the fans uh, standing up and going mad that 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 noise that they can generate was was great to see. And the FA Cup, you know, it's it's magical. There's a, there's a great buzz amongst the fans today, given what happened, the draw for the next round. Of course, you you experienced the run, didn't you? In your first season with Villa to the semi-finals. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. It's, it's it's a great great cup to be in. Uh, we're in the hat for the for the next round, and you know anything can happen. Well, you seen Bradford the other day beating Chelsea. Great interview by their their chap. It's a great interview by him. But yeah, uh, yeah I mean, out can happen. We're, we're looking to to go to go through in the last game. We're in the hat for the for the next round and see what happens. Yeah.